Hello and welcome for gamers. My name is Borek and this is another episode of Space Engineers Frostbite Scenario. In the previous episode we've managed to get over here to this outpost and I got myself a rover. Well actually I've modified the rover that, that I had from the start. I've put uh, a turret on top and I've managed to squeeze in here large... Is it large container? Yeah, that's a large container and I've managed also to put some armor on it uh, similar to the thing that I found on the rover uh, in a base over there, not to mention that I had to extend the length of the total of this god forsaken uh, 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 rover, so I've removed one wheel, added another one and put another one in the back. So that being said, I also managed to scavenge the stuff from the drone that was over there uh, to build some of the armor over here and I sca scavenged the, the, the some of the plates that were on that were on the drone over there in here right so in today's episode what we're gonna be doing we are going up there to the weather station we will check it out we will try to find some we will try and find some information some clues about uh, data containers that we are looking for uh, so let's get up there and let's see what we can... Oh, look at that, there's a gold over there. And uh, actually, I don't know if I will be able to get up there. Hopefully, slowly but surely, I should be able to get there. So there is some gold. Good. Right, I'm gonna go there and as soon as I will hit that target, I will let you guys know. Oh shit, smart missile drones. Uh... This is gonna be sketchy. This is gonna be sketchy. Oops, oopsies daisy, oops daisy. Let's just try it. Okay. Somehow I've managed to survive that attack. And this is really sketchy, you know. Uh, piloting that rover. In first person view is not that comforting and let's hope that uh, actually I won't fall off. Right. It's all good now, I guess. But the inclination over here to this mountain is really, really steep and my wheels are spinning all, almost all the time. I am really, really heavy trying to uh, maneuver over there. Uh, and it's been all the time like that right trying to get to the top as soon as I will get there <laughs> I will let you guys know right awkward righty so here we are at the top oh shit oh shit 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 something is shooting at me and my turret oh okay I think I know where it is There it is. Over there in the distance. Yeah, you can see it move now. All you need to do is just destroy that thing, Jig. I don't know if there's a bullet drop in this game or not. I don't think so. Do I have enough bullets? 800, that should be more than enough. Okay, I am destroying everything around it. The blocks above. I've hit something, now it still moves. Come on, game. I'm gonna be destroying all the blocks around it. But not the turret. Okay, I've killed the turret. Oh! Look down, there's something over there, up in the sky. Right. Let me just bring my rover over. <laughs> Let's bring my rover over. And unfortunately, we will, be have, to, we will have to be doing that in the darkness, checking what do we have over here. Uh, on the way to here I had to close my visor because uh, of the lack of the oxygen, uh -huh. I was being suffocating. 
So that, that, that doesn't sound right. Triton weather station. Offline. Whoopsie. <coughs> okay. That was kind of interesting. Now I have to watch out what I'm doing. Because you can die very, very easy in this game. Right, welder. Oh, I'm gonna... Oh, no. I have a... Not that bad welder for a start. What's this? Some sort of a, of a device. Don't know what that, what that is. But we have to look for some clues. So let's get back to looting and let's see what we can find. Those doors are open. That's nice. How do you like my pinky... Pinkie Pie version of a rifle. It's amazing, isn't it? Uh, you know what, let's just take it apart. Completely. Because that's gonna be much easier to get inside. Although that grinder is not that fast. And that's what worries me. <laughs> because it will take a bit of a time to get there. But here we are. Great. Enhanced trail. I have one on me, so not needed. Precise action rifle. Uh, actually, I'm gonna take it uh, just to have a spare in my rover. Oh man. Toilet. Something over there. I don't see any turrets, so that is a plus. And I've destroyed one. On the way here, on this, oh, enhanced gr grinder, that's nice. Because that will speed up the process of taking apart stuff. Right, let's go over here. Okay, vending machine, that's a kitchen. Some of the stuff has been destroyed over here. Wonder if there's gonna be somebody buried. What's this? That looks like a vent. No, maybe just uh, something. Ooh, nice. Nice control room. So what's that? Programmable block. I have absolutely no idea what does it do. Uh, <coughs> probably some deco. Right, in here we go and let's have a look. Control seat. Now, can I sit in it? Access denied. I know that I can hack it. But I'm not going to be doing that just yet. Let's first have a look what we can find in here. Any clues? Oh, there's a turret over there. Oh, and... Oh, that's a nice loot. Thank you, I'm going to take it all. Hello there. Right. Dead engineer. Oh, thanks. He had some... Xavier J Jarvis. Isn't that the same guy that we've seen rover technician? At the bottom, he was talking to contact his folks. It seems we've been fighting the drones forever. I don't know if these turrets I'm setting up can keep up the drones back, but it's worth a shot. Maybe they will uh, buy us just enough time for the rescue team to arrive. Sorry, that didn't happen. Who am I kidding? The ROS did this and one of and no one is coming to save us that's true only people we can rely on ourselves i'm gonna add the gps marker and see no i didn't got any except for um the thing that old mining base that we have to go to i'm preparing the turret to have access to its inventory because i want to take i just want to take the ammunition that it had Nice satellite dish. Nothing over here. Maybe if I take a, a leap of faith jump, maybe I would be able to get there on top or just walk up like normal people do. Right. I need to find some bodies. I need to find some information. I need to find some clues. Hello. Oh. That's just battery. 
Oh, there is somebody over there. In this control room. Oh, yeah. You could walk in as a normal person. Programmable block. I'm not that far to do any programmable things. Automatic rifle, I would just leave it over here. Right, let's get down. Because jumping in this game can lead to a serious injuries. And I don't want that. Right, so we are back at the control room. I don't think I will get any information whatsoever that would be helpful for me right now. Only try to get medical components, that's nice. Only try to get some information from the guys that are dead. Or try and find uh, any logbooks or whatever. That would give me enough clues. But I think that's it for this part of the station. Or am I missing something? If you know that, please let me know in the comments section below. But I don't see anything extraordinary. What's that? Oh, that was the rotor part. This one. <laughs> can grind it. Can I? Yes, I can. Just to get a cube and some display computers and so on. Inventory Inventory full. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. Nice turbine. That could provide me with some power. It could actually hook up my rover and charge it. But I fail uh, rebuild. Oh, actually, there's a uh, um, engine. Hydrogen engine. That wouldn't be s such a bad idea to have. Uh, mainly because of the fact that, you know, I could use all the ice over here to charge my beauty. Because now I'm running on purely on, on small batteries that I have. Okay, let me just unload some of the stuff. Like one precision rifle. I don't need that small grinder. Oh, there's not enough space in here. And the, what about large container? Is it full? No, it's not. Okay, grinder can go in here as well. One, another precision rifle. You know, I'd like to keep some of the stuff. No, 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 no. Some of the stuff with me. How do you split? No. Okay, I can do something like that. And that should be more than enough. Now it's time for the other building. Let me just uh, put over here the grinder. The enhanced grinder that I have. Good. Bridge unsafe. Good to know. Let's hope that I won't fall down. It's getting dark, so that kind of sucks. Ooh, that's a long way down. What the hell are those things? They look like batteries, but... Batteries usually have like four indicators. Right, there might be some turrets over here. Uh, with which I won't be able to fight with a drill. Right, now this is a big ass rover. Ooh, I like it in here. It's really nice. Does it have anything? Actually, I can turn it on. Whoa. Do you feel that diesel power? Amazing, isn't it? No. None of the blocks are actually... I can use them. There are some connectors. Inventory, let's just check. No, it doesn't have anything. Right. Uh, it's a bit too big for my needs right now. I think I will just stick with the rover that I have. But let's see what we can find in the other places. I could take it apart. Oh, that's a dirty, dirty window. I could take it apart, but... It will take way, 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 way too long stuff. Scrap metal, I'm not going to be taking that one. There's a basic assembler, so that's nice. I could charge my batteries over here, take a piss, and then drink coffee. Just after washing my hands. 
Oh, metal grid. That's good because metal grid is needed for my heavy armor. And I think I need cobalt to make those. Right, where does this lead to? Does it lead outside? I think so. Yeah, that must be the entrance. Right, but there's a hatch of some sort. Let's just try and go out and find the turret. Because there was a turret that I have destroyed. That was n not a nice glitch. Or a lag. Okay, let, let me just go over here. Oh, there's another entrance and some explosives. Nice, I like explosives. Don't know what to do with them yet, but I like explosives. And of course, not to mention the magazine. Walking up the ladder, walking up the ladder. It takes ages to climb the ladders in those games, in this game in particular. Unfortunately, you cannot slide down, so that kind of sucks. And you cannot move your head to scout what lies ahead. And that is something that I'm worried about. Now, I have destroyed half of the blocks in here. Like all that. That's all me. Right, let's try and repair it. Small tube. Where do I get the small tube from? No idea. Okay, here's some. Now motors. Where do I get motors from? What's that? Wait, I can't walk. Maybe there's gonna be something else over here as well. Hmm, don't think so. Right. I guess I have to walk down and look for some motors. Most probably I will find them indoors. Will I? Yes, four. I should be more than enough, but it will take ages for me to bend those doors down. Right, so I had to eventually go back to my rover and get those parts. Oh, look at that, seven, seven thingies. Seven um, ammunition cases. That's nice. Don't mind if I take the rest. So I went also over here and found some wheels over there that are supposed to be like pipes, which is really nice touch really nice touch what does it and that basically looks like a vent of some sort and also there is a place over here like the top of of this garage garage where the rover is and if you look closely over there there is a hatch on the side over there that was open so i am thinking if there's any oh look at that if there's any tunnel in that place. Let me just clear the way. This actually goes down. That's really nice. What's that blue thingy? Oh, that's a... a p -p 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 feet. <laughs> Not feet, uh, but a locker of some sort. Locking mechanism. And what's the doors? Oh man, it will take ages. Again, I need to find much better tools. Right. What do we have in here? Hello. Unfortunate guy. Uh, inventory. Right, so... Oh, proficient grinder. That's nice. That will speed up the process. And some some space credits. What's that? Oxygen bottle. Nice. And a PDA. ID card. No. ID card. Identification card. Name Dolores. So this is Dolores. Apparently, female players or female characters have been re uh, recently added to to this game. Uh, medical department chief surgeon. Well, that didn't help you, I guess. So let me just check GPS. No GPS. No new GPS marker. Right. What's that? Superconductors, medkits, platinum, and uranium. Most definitely, I should make myself uranium. Uh, should utilize the uranium generator that I had on that, on that other rover. What's this? Oh, that leads to the cantina. Right, we've been here. So nothing new. Now, let me just go over here to this rover, which apparently is offline. Can I get like up there somehow? 
What's this? Conveyor junction. That's a small hydrogen tank because we have big as hydrogen engine over here. Power cells, constructor motors, lead tubes. I don't think there's anything that I need. Oh, except for the fact that I'm stuck between those wheels. Oh man. Five by five wheels. Since that I'm not gonna be using this guy for travels, although it looks amazing. But I think it's a bit too big for my comfort. Right, we've also seen a base that is over there on the top. Like you can see the, 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 the you can see the blinking eye over there in the distance, like over there. But there. But there is no road, at least no road is visible for me. And I don't want to go there on foot just to find myself in the death situation. So I'm gonna be going downstairs since we still have to go to that old mining base and by the looks most probably there's gonna be a way up from the somehow. So let me just go down the hill and then we shall continue at the bottom. Fair enough? That's okay with you? I hope so. Oh, that was a wheel. I need to repair something. As I was driving downwards, I found myself with a beautiful view. Imagine a daylight without fog and snowing, but you can see the base that we've... I think this is the base where we've started. Yeah, most definitely, and there's... Down there, there's an outpost. So there is old mining base in the distance that you can see. I think I can see some uh, antenna shape like something. And also, not to mention that there's something over there, down there. So this is really cool. I really like uh, those views. Uh, unfortunately, the weather is not satisfying. But and look at the look at this angle. Oh man, I had no idea that uh, I'm gonna be driving over here. I don't want to speed up because I will fall off the cliff. So that's gonna be a really interesting experience. Am I gonna fit? Am I gonna fit? I can't stop. I don't have... I don't... Oh shit. I had no control whatsoever. Is my turret turned on? Now it's turned on, okay. Oh shit. Oh, red markers. Red markers. I have to run. I have to run. I have to run. Okay. So it just exploded above my head. But fortunately nothing happened. Right. Let me just get down there towards the station where we were at. And let's try not to crash during that decline. Oh shit. I don't like when things do those horrible noises. And unfortunately night kicked in. <gasps> And I can't see anything. And the fog is all over the place. Right. Let me just get the proper angle. Oh, ah, oh, ah, shit. I'll destroy something in just a second. Okay. That worked quite, or quite all right. So, I guess we are gonna go towards the mining station. Um. But is that the road that I should follow? I have absolutely no idea. It goes down. I don't know if that is a road. It actually doesn't look like. But I don't have any other idea. So I'm gonna be following that route. I can see some lights in the distance. A route or route, as some say. Uh oh. Uh oh. Turret. Shoot, goddammit. Oh, that lit up. Okay. I guess there were some drones after all.
Now, where we're at? Oh shit. What was that? It was shooting at me, so... Okay, quit firing. I want to scavenge that one. Maybe I will find some ammunition over there. Because I don't have that much. Yeah, that was a scout. Oh, look at that. There's some ammo, there's some ammo. Nice, nice, nice. Anything in here? No idea. There's another ammunition. And another box of ammo. That's good, that's good. Those things will always come in hand. What's that? Light armor, heavy armor block. That's good because all of those blocks will give me each metal grid one, 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 one metal grid, or actually two, and I need that for my armor. Not to mention those thruster engines that I can take apart, and with this nice grinder, it just takes like moment to take it apart. Now let's go in that base and have a look what we can find over there except for death and annihilation am i riding a bit too low or do you think my inventory is is a bit heavy yeah i think i might be back heavy heavy but should i increase the ride height i think i should because you can set the offset of those wheels now Let's see what we can find in here. Hello, chump. What the heck? What are you? Offline. That is what? Control panel? Sensor access denied. If I hack it, will I be able to take control of that thing? Remote control access denied, small battery timer block, transparent LCD, ejector. Oh, to eject stuff on site, like mines most probably. ROS. For brighter future in deep space. Good. Ooh. Okay, that's that's cool. Does this thing have a turret on top? It looks like. Right, first of all, let's check that location. Ooh, a lit automatic rifle. What does it do? I have absolutely no idea, but I'm going to, to use it. Yes, sorry. That's me. Okay. Uh, weapons. It's going to be better. I have absolutely no idea. But it's elite. Ooh. Okay, okay. Let's see what else we can find. Ooh, some clank cola. What do I do with it? Do I drink it? Do I have to drink it? Some large tube in the lockers. Just some ammo, that's nice. I thought for a second that I had my lights turned off, but it is foggy as hell. You can feel the tension. It's like sauna in here all of a sudden. Okay, that is the look that I was looking for. Oh, hello. Okay, that leads upstairs. So I guess he only had some iron. I think that leads outside. And look at that, it takes so less time with this grinder. It's like a second to take apart those doors. 
instead of minutes. I'm terribly sorry about the weather, but there is not much I can do about the weather itself. Good. Oh, there's another poor dude. Bianca Curiela. Let's see what she has to say. At first people were only getting into arguments about food now, but now fights are breaking out over all kinds of supplies. If this gets any worse, we won't stand a chance against the drones. Right. Ah. Okay. Now, how do I open those doors? No idea. There was a control panel over here. Uh, use gate. First, let's go on this over here to that sliding door to see what we can find because I don't like that guy over there in the distance. Most definitely, that looks like a gun because I have one on my ship, so I know how it looks. Okay, no any other bad things. I'm getting heavy with all the equipment that I have already found. There's light. What's that? Large engine that looks like a vent, mine vent. What? 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 Oi, dude. Give me back that ammunition, it's mine. Right. Um, timer block, I think I can take this one apart. Small battery. Scrap metal, no, gyroscope. Is there any remote control over here? Could you just stop? Please, thank you. There's a remote control. That should stop it. Stop the movement. Right, let me just go and empty myself. Okay, so I'm back and let's... Come on. Let's hug this baby. Let's get back and see what's inside. Nothing? That's a fairly disappointing thing. That looks like a minor unit. Because it does have a large drill in front. But does it have anywhere near here? Any container whatsoever? Inventory full. Why, it's... Oh yeah, it's back heavy, look at that! I should do something about that, most definitely. And I need to take this apart. Will we have access to any terminal port whatsoever? There's this thing, connector. There's going to be something over there in that connector, I have no idea, but I'm willing to test it out. Some motors, I need some motors, where do I get motors from? And some, now some computers, great. 
Patchy doesn't have any computers. Left is some gyroscope with computers. Three, that should be enough. Hopefully. Now I need three more. Inventory full. Yeah, sure, I get it. Uh, okay, okay. I just want to, you know, have access to that connector. To see if there's gonna be something of an interest to me. Come on, game! Don't I have any computers? Ah, that was a waste. Waste of mine and your time, but that's fine. Right, nothing over here. This is the place where the small rover was, but this... This is something that I would like to get. Inventory full. Okay, I'm gonna take apart stuff as I'm done with loading all the compon all components with deposited. Right, but what do we have over there? That's a wheel. That's a wheel. So it looks more like... Um, a ventilation pipe. So I guess... Something caved in... Here. Small hydrogen tank. I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna be touching it, because it will most probably explode as soon as I hit. Oh, there's a poor fella. He was caved in. <sighs> Look at that. Professional, proficient hand drill. And some iron ore deposit. Unfortunately, I don't have a refinery on my ship to refine all that ore into something more useful. Oh, most probably that sensor activated the guy that was over there. Fair, fair, fair enough. Okay, yeah. I'm terribly sorry about the fog, but what can you do? I guess not much. I will have to work on my guy, because it is getting a bit too ridiculous. Uh, yeah, three tons in the connector itself, and over there we have 14. No, 37. It's like a truck squeezed in one, squeezed in one container. Uh, I guess I will have to increase the right height. I will do something about that, but yeah, we're gonna be slowly wrapping up this episode. Fortunately, we've managed to survive. I have not died yet a single time, so that's good. I have destroyed some drones, some missile drones, but still. I have destroyed some turrets, which is also good. I found some decent tools, so it's not that bad. And how do, do you like my rainbow gun? It is awesome, don't you think? Yeah, I think so too. Right, so that's gonna be it for today's episode, guys and girls. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment about the gameplay, subscribe to the channel if you're new and you like what you see. And I hope that we will see each other in the next episode. And then we'll continue our awesome adventure with this awesome game. So, did it easy, have fun, and happy gaming. Ta-da! Walking in the jungle, walking in the jungle.